where Benzema is. Beaten both at the confirmation of what we knew perhaps even three years back. Aspiring Champions League showdown for Barca this springtime. Pretty soon, no more. Well, Gavi. What a clearance that was. Camavinga, the unaccustomed Real Madrid left back, but he was needed there. A lightning break from Barca. Yeah, that's what they've got to look for, that little counter-attack and get with every reason. That seemed to be on the upper body, let's put it like that. Gavi's leading the protest. The referee seemed to indicate chest or stomach. I think it is his arm actually, but it's whether he's his arm's really sort of away from his body. It's, if he's tucked it in things and two massive clubs with when you think of the history in the bar's got it back, lays it off, taking shot in the end. And Port was able to drop on him. Got a with their to help him out. But Real Madrid are having to deal with a lot of issues across them. Real Madrid. Well having superlative covering. By about four. What a ball into the path of Vinicius Junior here. That's a fabulous ball across, isn't it? Similar to the goal in the Champions League final against it. Similar to the goal in the Champions League final against Liverpool. They've made a lot of headway down there, left Barcelona early on tonight. No free kick. Barely one back. Great ball, and Ter Stegen stayed very cool indeed. What a run it was. This is Vinny Junior. Going to go back for the free kick, a few yards. Finish Junior and Garvey on the yellows after that. Not a great header by Camavinga. Space is here, wrapping down to the side of home, getting that extra little bit of... Benzema pulling away. Perfectly done by Ter Stegen. That's the best bit of it. That's far away. No carry over the last few years, but that is correct, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, some. Vinicius Junior. Angling it in. Gabi. Almost. Uh, and made a difference here in this first half. He's played well. Junior joins in. Lewandowski, brilliant stop, first time by Courtois. Benzema reverses it, Vinicius Junior off the line, but the ball is running. Real Madrid score, the tie is level. Dear me, what a bit of action. One minute you think Barcelona have just gone 2 0 up, aggregate, and suddenly at the, at the other end they've got themselves an equaliser. What a break, and that's the break that we just look at. I mean, they were on the, on the rails, really, weren't they? They are on the ropes as, as such, really, in this game. They've been pinned back, just waiting for a little bit of a break, and, and it's wonderful play. 3v2, lovely ball. Suddenly they came up with a big moment. Normally, it isn't really a good show. All about. We'll see what El Clasico is all about in this captivating first half. Real Madrid soaked up the pressure. Barcelona looked so assured for so long. Creating most of the for the last few minutes to, to, to go again. Uh, they played a lot of very good stuff again tonight. Uh, Martinez, Monellas, patience and metal was tested. Well, oh, goal is beaten, all ends up. Koundé just about kept his body shape right. I thought he was about to turn his back on that. He's suggesting that they're being asked to do some defending Barcelona. Luka Modric glides towards the penalty box.
in league and cup and in Europe. And in this cup tie, it's turning against Barcelona. Well, I think one thing for sure, what Real have done, they've put more uh, bodies up higher to press the ball. Balde into the penalty box and let's go. And it's palmed away by Thibaut Courtois. That last five minutes of the first half. And early in this second half, the quality's improved. The edge is there. A great take. And it's a good duel now. And Kamavinga. Kamavinga won't get to this. Alaba was closing him down. And uh, Kamavinga returns the high five to Alaba. Yeah, it's so interesting. Box and he's still got it. And Alho! What a famous goal that would have been. so well to get in that position there. He decides to go for the toe poke. Oh, this could be the moment. It's a penalty to Real Madrid. Barcelona's defending is less than secure on this big, big occasion. Araujo, who very nearly scored at the other end, under pressure. Vinicius Junior might have been on a hat trick, but it's certainly his second. And Real Madrid are in danger of running away with it here. Yeah, such a cool, calm penalty taker, isn't he? Yeah, he just steps up, full of confidence, and uh, strokes it again like his goal, like his first goal, and just strokes the ball. Doesn't go for power, just goes for accuracy, and. Uh, Oh, Madrid find themselves in a, such a strong position now. That because it might get worse. Luka Modric. It should have been. Volkessing on. Asensio's come on. Meantime. Confidence has left the building at the moment here. Behind this Barcelona new project. It's becoming very patchy, this performance. Lots and lots of mistakes. Can't get any pattern of play, can they? Oh, what a miss that is! It's he knows Benzema. That was it for the hat trick. Barcelona clocked off altogether. A cross trick. Asensio and it's turned around the post. Good save by Ter Stegen. But Real Madrid are rolling forward unstoppably. Yeah, they give the ball away again. Barcelona they just breaks so quickly, and uh, it's a really good save this time. He's made a couple of really poor clear it. Options both sides again. Here comes Benzema. That will be his hat trick. Magnificent. Karim Benzema stealing the show here tonight. And Real Madrid lead 4 0 here away to Barcelona. The job is done. 4 1 on aggregate. Yeah, they hit on the counter again. They've done it all evening. It was an easy go, it looks easy, but at the end of the day, I think they end up with a 3v2. And you just watch Benzema's run, he just, he's nice and patient, just comes away from the plug. But no hiding place to Balde. Benzema stepped in here, look, his arm round, just say, get yourself off. Surely not, surely not. But he might get one. Oh, he's going to his, his kick. Forlorn cries all around. It's his cross, and it's catching practice. Shabby and his players, and the team will learn a hell of a lot.